very, very thirsty, and they could drink milk. Anyone who does milk. So my name is Michael Loder, um, and I'm a storyteller. And today we've been at St George's and performing with a company called Wild Words. So that's myself and a number of other musicians and storytellers. So this piece of uh, storytelling theatre we did today was all about Odysseus and the Odyssey and his adventures. They saw a wooden horse standing on the beach and dragged it back to town. It's very much me being an actor, playing a character, acting out the story and telling the story. Once upon a time, there was a prince, the Prince of Troy. I think storytelling is very important. I think it's a wonderful thing for a family to share. Experiencing a story or piece of theater live, it's so immediate. The energy, I think, that is coming from the stage is going to the audience, coming back to the stage, going back to the audience, and an energy sort of moving around the room. Um, yeah, it's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've answered that one. <laughs> And then he went to his little doggy bag and brought out his stick. I need midnight snack. <laughs> um, storytelling, it actually came down to one phone call. A friend phoned me out the blue and said, I've got this um, storytelling gig from an agent and I don't really feel confident about it. Would you like to do it? And I just thought, yeah, let's, let's give it a go. And at that time, the theatre I was doing um, was very content-less. So we went on stage not knowing what we are going to do. So getting into storytelling and actually knowing what the story is before you tell it was um, a real sort of eye-opener and sort of went from there, really. As a storyteller, you don't really need any props. You don't need a backdrop or lighting or scenery or costume props. You just, just turn up and start telling stories. I mean, I love storytelling because it brings people together, different ages together as well, in a very sort of simple way. Like you saw in the show today, kids and mums and dads are, are ready to take part and uh, step into that space where their imagination can come alive. If they go away from today knowing a story, enjoying an experience with their family, and go off and retell the story, or you know, go off and be creative and use their imaginations. I think imagination is 